Hello and welcome back to this roller coaster of a be a pro. We went from new season, new me, to get me out of here right now, to we're in the playoffs against the LA Kings up 2-1. So that is something. I do still want to get out of here. You know, it's been fun with the Ducks and everything, but the GM just doesn't seem to be making any moves to improve the team. They think that what we have right now is it, and I assure you, it is not. But obviously, we might as well partake in the playoff run just to see what happens. Scott Sterling up to 85 overall. Clearly, that's not helping because we have a 481 GAA along with a 852 save percentage. Great stats. We're killing it. So I can show you guys the lines here once again just so we know what we have. And Zegris, Barabanov, and Terry is our first line. Not bad. Strom, Formenton, and McTavish. I mean... McTavish is good. The other two are more so third liners, or they would be on what I believe to be a championship team. When did we get Nicholas Backstrom? Has he been here this... Well, it's playoffs, so I guess so. Maybe he was in the minors. Is someone injured? Let's figure that out. No. So maybe he's been there and I just completely overlooked him. This Sasha individual has gone off. I feel like I've seen him score a few nasty goals. Defensively, we even got worse here. Like, I don't know how we're in the playoffs. I'm going to be honest. Scott and John, the one-two punch. And it is time to hopefully go up three to one against the LA Kings. Otherwise, we have a best of three which I don't want. So far in this short sample size of a series, we've been scored on the first, second, third, fourth, sometimes all shots of the game. So if we could make the first five saves, that would be great. Game number four in Anaheim at the Honda Center. Let's see how we do right here, right now. We saved the first two shots, so we are off to a roaring start. And now we are out shooting them drastically. Just two more saves. Two more saves and you have met my promise. Nope. Couldn't do it. one nothing after one. We are out shooting them by double. It is 18 to 9 in the shots category. They now have 11. Thank you, Strom. You know what? Yeah, I agree. I was just saying you should be a third liner and you go out there and get a goal. I don't want to take credit for you scoring, but I'm just saying that I definitely played some part there. Tie game going in to the third and maybe final period of play. Let's do this thing. One goal, and we're in the lead. Or one... I checked, by the way. I have tethering disabled on the main screen. And still, I have to do it every time here. I try to see if there's, like, a controller settings in the regular Be a Pro menu, and there isn't. So maybe I just have to do this the first game every time. Maybe I'm dumb, and there's a different way to do it. Oh! Jeez, Terry just got lit up. That was a big hit. So the LA Kings are making moves. They've got Zuccarello. They've got Chikrin. Just a few players they've added. Here's Fiala. Glove save. Byfield crashing the net. He has been very good this year, by the way. Let's freaking go. The poke check absolutely missed. He tried his best, but it wasn't good enough. Captain Troy, after getting leveled, sends one in front to Barabanov. It is a 2-1 lead for your Mighty Ducks. They even took a timeout. They're nervous. They're scared. Look at them. Claude Giroux and LA King as well. I feel like I went over this last game about how, you know, clearly their GM trying to do something. But ours is not. What a play by Claude. I didn't see that coming at all. I actually somehow made the initial kind of save there, but... It wasn't good enough because it went off me and in. I can't even be mad about that one. That was just a veteran play from a veteran player. Toe drag. Both of our players bit into that for some reason. And he just sends it over to 3-4 for the easy tap in. Well done. Let's get it back, lads. I know you can do it. Drysdale gains the line. Great try. Okay. I see you. They are listening. And they know they can get it back as well. Kempe coming out with it now for the LA Kings, and he gets leveled by Barabanov. I guess that's payback. Nope. Off the blocker and in the corner. Drysdale also wins the battle and draws a penalty. What an icon. Another big hit by Doughty. Can someone please step up to this man? Because we cannot allow this to fly any longer. I'd scrap him if I could, but I can't. Unfortunately, I can only go the other goalie. 
Let's go. Let's not go. That pass down to Trevor was a little sus. This video is going to end up being seven minutes with all that I have to cut out. I just can't speak today. I literally cannot English. Draw win from Byfield. Oh, get destroyed with the glove save. Thought he had it on the one timer. And you know what? He had reason to believe that he did have that because scary place to shoot from. But guess who wasn't nervous? If he went back to Trevor, guaranteed goal. But no. Wanted to be in the limelight. Unreal. You know what else was unreal? That shot. Get the puck out. I don't like it. You know what? I take everything back. I am nervous. I don't know about you guys. Maybe I've already talked about this, but I'm actually a really big fan of the dynamic boards in this game. It doesn't really feel distracting, but when you actually look at it, it's really cool. I don't know. Big save by Freddy from the shot at the dot. And here comes Giroux again. Is he going to cook? No, he's not this time around. Right about the three minute mark here. Still a tie game. Overtime. Very possible. Oh, okay. Nice shot, Sharon Govich. And he drew a penalty. Fire me up. Oh, no. I can't wait to be traded. Sick power play unit there, boys. It's exactly what we wanted. I don't know. I just got pulled and decided, no, I'm going to stay here and try to make a save. But even though I was still in the net, it was defaulting to the bench skate mode. I... Whatever. It's a best of three. That shorthanded goal I probably could have had. I just didn't expect them to get a chance like that while we're on the power play. So I was kind of just waiting for our team to 3v1 the guy in the corner, get the puck, go down the other way. But alas, no. Coach is somehow still happy. So we got that going for us. Keeping consistent with the sub 900 save percentage and for GAA. Really the question for me here is, are we going to be starting next video with a game seven or will we be starting next video in a new season on a new team or in the second round? You know, there's so many possibilities with these next two games. And by so many, I mean three, three different possibilities. Just don't get scored on the first five shots. All right. That's not too much to ask for. I think that's insanely reasonable. There we go. Can't do it, Kenya. Byfield scores, 2-0, 7 shots. At least we got one from Trevor. Freddie Anderson's stats have to be nearly as bad as mine. Actually, no. They're definitely not that bad. But they ain't good. Power play for LA and we kill it off, but then they score anyway. Dubois buries one. Let's get one more. Thank you. And hopefully, we have another tie game going into the third. That's what I want right now, ideally, because I want to run it back from last game. I want a redo. All right, just save the first shot, set the tone, and you know what? Had me. Had me. I thought we were getting scored on. Guaranteed right there. Okay, so what should I do here? Not, like, come out too far, obviously, because they also just had the puck behind the net, so they are everywhere right now. Send it out. Please carry this out of this zone. Thank you, Olin. Great pass, too. All right, counterattack, and we just missed the net. That would have been one of the largest Uno reverse cards in history if we would have scored on that rush. But let's score on this one. That sounds good, too. Trevor's in. Goes for the pass, but Kempe read that. Giroud just has my number. That's the only thing I can say. I just don't understand why in this game sometimes it actually feels like I couldn't stop a beach ball. I don't think my positioning was bad there. I think I was pretty square to the shooter. And, you know, I was out as much as I should have been. I don't know. I can't even say it's overall anymore because we are up to 85. We've got an X factor, an ability. All right. Now score. Good shot. Freddie Anderson's all over it, though. Olin, 
to Barabanov. Great passing, and we just missed the net. Almost had one off the backboards there, too. And Freddy sauces it out. Certified mad lad. All right. Well, you know what? I'm going to scrap two then. Let's throw Freddy off his game. Bye, field. That was Doughty that we just took out? Am I able to go? Or... No? I'm trying to skate up, and nothing is working. Unless Freddy just straight up doesn't want to go me. Very possible. Could I be, like, trapped behind the net or something? Oh, no. We're here. Fair enough, Freddy. You know what? That's smart by him. I don't like it, but I respect it. McTavish won his fight, so he just injured Doughty. Oh. He's getting kicked out? That's a joke, referee. Five minute power play incoming for the Kings. Sick shot. It would have been even cooler if it would have been on the net. Go! Skate? No. Tens all over it. First of all, that passing play, unbelievable. Still made the save, though. Nope. Throw it over to Drysdale, who does get rid of it. But it was, again, just an absolutely pathetic attempt at getting the puck down the ice. All right, well, we went from being up by one in the series to down by one. And we are one game away from being deleted. We just took another penalty. Oh, no, they let it go. All right. Thanks, ref. <laughs> I kind of hope we do lose next game. Because... I need to get out of here. Like, I feel like at this point, just being in Anaheim is, like, morally defeating me. But knowing the way things go, we're most likely going... <laughs> My positioning was so bad there. Most likely going to win next game and then somehow end up winning game seven in the next video. Because I want to lose. Oh, we did get it. Nice. All right. Thought we were going to get finessed with the post hit, which we still kind of did. But thankfully, Troy Terry was on the doorstep to bury it, still. So, Zegers comes in, lets it sing, and... I mean, was not intentional, but we take those. Okay... See what I'm saying? I want to lose so bad, guys. What are you doing? Oh, darn. Get out of here, Fiala. Coming in all quick and whatnot. I can't, like, might as well just pull me. You'd be better with six skaters on the ice. Did he save that rebound? Hold on. That will be ridiculous if he... He must have. You're joking. You see this? 99% of people are going to say this goes in. But Freddie Anderson... Oh my word. Has Doughty been back out on the ice? I haven't really been paying attention. I don't think so, though. Oh, no. It's Giroux. Please take the puck off of him. Claude is so rent-free in my head right now. It is unbelievable. Let's get off the ice and hope that the lads can bury another one. I mean, no, let's hope they don't because I want to get out of here. And then we can lose the next game. And that will be our last game ever in a Ducks uniform. Yeah, let's go with that. Claude in the middle to Chikrin. He loses it. Lacombe goes cross ice. Nice, gets my byfield. And they're taking a penalty, but there is five seconds left. We did win the draw. Nah, Freddy's got it. Well, GG. I mean, it wasn't. It's more like bad game. Also, there's 0, 0.0 seconds left on the clock, and somehow we got a shot. That checks out. The Be A Pro roller coaster continues. Maybe we'll push seven. I am, again, kind of hoping we don't, honestly. Well, let's do it here. Times eight. They have a shot, and they didn't score. They have two shots and they didn't score. Three! We're about to set a world record. Five shots, no goal. We're winning. 100% we're winning. You can't change my mind. There it is. 
Zegra scores, 1-0 Ducks after one. Another power play for the Kings that is killed off by the Ducks. We have been very good simulation-wise at killing off penalties. In the game, we haven't been good at anything, really. We haven't been good on the power play, PK, even strength, you name it. We're terrible. But we do have a 1-0 lead heading into the third period. We are one game away from having our season come to an end and having Scott Sterling never lace up the boots, the pads, whatever he's lacing up for the Ducks again. Even if we do somehow win this game and go on to win the next one, game seven, move on to round two, if we go on an absolute run, I still would like to get out of here. Let's go, Trev. Gained the line, immediately lost it, but at least we laid a big hit. That should be good for momentum. Byfield in the corner. Okay, so I need to challenge. Don't challenge the shooter like that. That was horrible positioning. Get out of here, Kaliev. Oh my word, my positioning is still really bad. They didn't score. Here they come again. Kempe gains the line. For sure thought he was doing a little TDR action there. But instead, he spins off and dishes it to Dubois, who ends up losing it. But we still cannot get the puck out. Is Doughty here? I feel like he's still gone. Puck meets Irene. Run it back. McTavish gets denied this time. Another one shot is blocked. We're getting so close to grabbing that insurance marker. But we can't quite grab it. Come on, Drysdale. No can do. Ripped it. Absolutely sent that thing. But unfortunately, it was a field goal. Here's Quinton. Loses it to Sasha. That's our guy. And he was not happy that he lost it. Because Sasha just got obliterated on the boards. Thankfully. Actually, not thankfully. We're going to the power play, which doesn't mean anything. Here we go again. Turcotte behind the net. Saved that one. But yeah. They literally got the exact same chance. Are we on the power play or not? Can someone do some fact checking? Because according to my research, we are. But we definitely aren't playing like it. Alright, setting up a little bit of something here now. But still amounts to nothing. Trevor's putting in an effort. He really is. Great shot by Pesci. Wow. Got it sent over to him from Zegris, maybe? Not really sure, but... Yeah, he sent that thing... Top corner. Freddie Anderson didn't stand a chance. Boom. It was Trevor. Tape to tape. Magic. Four assists. Pretty cool camera work. And... Yeet. Okay, well... Maybe not so cool camera work after all. Under seven to go. And we now have the dreaded two goal lead. The worst lead in hockey, so they say. But I think we got this. We're pushing a game seven. Next video is going to be for all the marbles. We did just take a penalty. So this could turn things around real quick for the LA Kings. Obviously, I hope it doesn't. But it sure could. Fiala passes down low to Byfield. He's not going to come out with it. Yeah, he passes it and... There was no screen, nothing. And Scott still couldn't catch that. We managed to kill it off. All right, good job, Ducks. You guys don't have to be in a rush to get the puck down the ice. Go, just come back, you know? No, you don't have to move that way. Come on, Bokefist. Have you never played Hockey Ultimate Team? Actually, I'm pretty sure they added a penalty for that now. So I don't think you really can do that. There's most likely a workaround that people have found, I'm sure. But, you know, at least they tried to do something about it. Empty netter for Olin. He is fired right up. I mean, he just essentially secured a game seven. So I'd be pretty gassed too. It would be pretty cool to end the video with a shutout. So if that goose egg remains, this could be exactly what we need going into Game 7. 
I feel like it could also fuel the Kings a little bit. But I think the positive momentum on our side from getting said shutout is going to outweigh the LA Kings momentum of wanting to absolutely light me up because of it. There we go. Great win. 36 saves, Shuddy. That's more like it. Probably first start of the game, too. Come on. Come on. Oh, yeah. Show me some Trevor highlights. Good pass and whatever. But you know what's even crazier? Zero goals against. boy, Scott. Well, round one comes down to one game. And it is in the LA Kings Arena. Crypto? Is that what it is? We do have some perks that we can unlock. I wonder if I can get any that give me X-Factor slot thingies. This one does. 700k. Purchase that. Insufficient funds. Anything else I could buy that gives me an X-Factor point. Collectible art, $1 million. No thanks. This gives me an X-Factor point. I do have to renew it, but I think it's worth it. An art advisor. Gets you two X-Factor points and two trade points. That's a pretty good one. Stay on your current team for six or more years. No, not gonna happen. What's this one? Get a team like ability of 7,500. Ooh, yeah, that's also not happening. This man is a unit. 12 points in six games. Can't overlook Terry, has 11 points. Barabonov with 10. Then it falls off to McTavish with five. But still, Gibson had to come in relief for me, I guess. Wait. Hold on, it seems like he played pretty much a whole game. When did that happen? That shutout definitely helped our stats, but still well below a 900 save percentage. Just below a 4 GAA. Not good. Freddie Anderson with a 367 and an 891. So yeah, he is also doing miserably. And they don't have players with as many points as us. We're winning game 7. Or maybe we are. Is Doughty still out? Still injured. There's only three series still going on. It is the Battle of the New Yorks, and then we have the Devils and Columbus, and also the Kings and the Ducks. We're the only Western Conference series that remains. Well, thank you for watching. Appreciate you, and looking forward to next video. It's going to be a good one, because we either win Game 7 and move on to Round 2 against... Does it reseed, or would we go against the Canucks? Honestly, I don't know. But either way, we'll either move on to Round 2, or we lose... You know what's going to happen next. We're getting out of here. I will see you soon.